hope. I hope you're right. Oh, you guys have identical cameras practically. So, so I'm with Rogue. No, I'm not with Rogue. I'm with, we are the real Latino review. Right. But anyways. But you're also the Asian review, right? No, I'm not the. <laughs> you could tell I'm Asian. Yes, of course. Oh, well, yeah. I, I have the Latino behind the camera. <laughs> All right, so it's legitimate. Yeah, yeah. You know, we're, we're halfway there. I should host Latino Review. Well, you, you should host Welcome Latino Review. Welcome to the show. Well, we, we just reviewed well, Latinos. We just reviewed Latinos. Tell me up next, Jimmy Smith. I, I speak on behalf of Latinos. <laughs> That's great. Thank you. Yeah. Anyways, what attracted you to like a scary movie like, like this from Deliver from... The money was really appealing. I like money. <laughs> um, well, no, I mean, uh, you, I don't know if you've seen any of the movie, but it's a really good movie. Thank you. That's right. Uh, but Scott Derrickson wrote and directed it and had me in mind when he wrote the role that I played. Uh, so I was thrilled to, yeah, well, but see if Scott's direction had been good, it would have been a good movie. <laughs> but it's basically an episode. <laughs> it looks a lot like an episode of Sanford and Son. It's weird. It's uh -huh. No, um, it, uh, it, it, yeah, I was thrilled to be in the movie, and I, I, it was like a dream come true to work with Scott and uh, to work with Eric Bana and Edgar and Olivia and Sean Harris. And so I really was like, I felt like I won the lottery. So. Now you're you're best known for like comedy and all this kind of stuff, but right. you're, you're moving to a, like a horror thing, you're, you're right? Not, it's you're, like you're, an you're, Asian guy hosting Latina Review. Yeah. Like in your mind, it's like, hey, it's fine with me. Yeah. It's not hard for you. You know, I can do this, right? So same thing. It's like, uh, you know, it's a it's a thriller. It's definitely a horror movie movie as well. But uh, people are like, Can, is it weird for you? And I'm like, eh, I don't know. It, it, oh, good. No, it, what was, I, I was more, I was thrilled to do it. So, um, uh, you know, I used to act in all sorts of different things. It was just that comedy was kind of how I was, I became known somewhat in the business. In the business, that's how we say it. So, uh, yeah, so I was, I was thrilled. So no, no uh, comedy uh, wonders? Uh, oh, uh, my character definitely tells jokes. That's... The movie has to have some lightness to it uh, because it is dealing with heavy subjects, and any movie that takes itself too seriously is not going to be great, uh, or you know, it's, you'll not take it seriously. So uh, you, so to have, you know, it's like real life. There are jokes. And um, just to wrap it up, uh, obviously, community, community can't last forever, but is there, is, will there be a movie? Well, hope, we're trying to get to our next season, and uh, and and then we'll hopefully start thinking about a movie. But um, I'm I would love to do a sixth season, and if they'll uh, if they pick it up, I'm I'm on board. So is everybody else. So um, it would be terrific. Dan Harmon's back, and I think he just, just kicked ass this season. So I would love to I would love to do it again. Awesome. Hey, thank you for talking to uh, Asian Latino uh, multi Latino review. Mr. What's your last name? Uh, Pata Numotan. <laughs> Holy <laughs> Lord. I don't even know what that was. Thank you. That sounded Aztec. <laughs> kind of. All right. Right on. Nice yeah. to meet you. Oh, yes. Yes. <laughs> right. You've got to make this legitimate. You've got to make it what, what, it, what, it, what it's actually called. Okay. You're all set. Thank, Thank you. you. All right. Look at the mirror. Okay. This is amazing. Hey,